And we are back, live. Card Shop Eric here, live from Hall of Fame Baseball Cards, Arcadia, California. Getting ready to continue with our Monday Night Personal Breaks series. Thanks to you guys, this is episode number 11. Uh, we were out of town last Monday, as you guys may or may not remember. Uh, so we didn't get a chance to do personal breaks last Monday, but we are back today and continuing today. Uh, up first is going to be Jeff M. Uh, Jeff M., thanks so much for being patient with us here as we get back in the saddle. You are first up today with a couple of nice packs, Archive Signature Series, Panini Leather and Lumber. He's up to bat. On deck, we got Bill B. with Alan and Ginter, Richard Martinez. Uh, got a box of some Panini Encased Basketball. That should be fun to look at. And that's what's kicking us, kicking us off today. I see people jumping into the group chat right now, including Soup. What's up, buddy? Uh, if you guys are jumping in, if you're watching, and you want us to break boxes of cards for you tonight during this two-hour live stream, here's what you got to do. First, click that link that Luis Valdez just dropped into our group chat right there. That link is going to take you to our website. Follow me on the screen here. Here's our home page. That link is going to take you to our group breaks pages, which look like this. You can sign up for the Bowman Mixer group break that we have available if you like. But for tonight, personal breaks. Any other of these products on screen that say personal breaks in the title, you buy those right now and we will open them for you right now. And you get free shipping on all these products. Brand new this week was Bowman Chrome, as we all know. Would love to rip some Bowman Chrome for people today. Get in on a box of Hobby, $159.99, shipped. How about the quick rip of the Bowman Chrome HTA, $189.99 shipped. Do you want to do just a half little mini box? We got mini boxes of Bowman Chrome, including six packs, one autograph per mini box, $99.99 shipped. Plus all these other products on here, uh, Origins Football, uh, Chronicles Baseball. I'm just going to list off a couple. We still got Bowman Sterling, Topps Tribute. We still got some Star Wars boxes. We got some football boxes available. We got five different pages of group breaks. As you can see, there's something for everybody. Scroll through, see what fits your budget, what fits your interest, then drop the order, and we'll rip it for you guys right now. It's a lot of fun. So that said, let's get on over back to the main screen here and uh, kick it off. I see people chiming in right now. As I'm getting into these first boxes for Jeff M., uh, why don't we do some location shout-outs? We are located at Hall of Fame Baseball Cards in Arcadia, California, but we like to know where everybody else is watching from. Drop your location into the group chat. We'll give a few shout-outs as they come through. And uh, get those personal break orders in right now. Get next in line. We need a cleanup hitter right now. We got one, two, and three. We need somebody to back cleanup. Who's going to be in the four spot right now? Get those personal break orders in right now. Uh, we got MLB fan in Toronto. We got Kaysen in Lake Zurich. Caleb in Illinois. Michigan sports cards in Michigan. Uh, Griffin in Georgia. d -backs Gaming, Flagstaff. Jeff, uh, I believe these are your boxes in Cincinnati. Thanks for tuning in. Glad to see you. Let's get right into your boxes right now. Jeff, uh, do you have a preference, Jeff? I am talking right to you now. Keep your ears on and your fingers ready to type. Do you have a preference which one of these packs you want to see open first? you want to see the, the leather and lumber, or do you want to see the archives? And while you're responding to that, I'm going to introduce uh, Jaden right here to my right. Jaden is uh, my friend Yama, Chris. It's his nephew. How old are you, Jaden? I'm six. Six years old, and uh, he's new to the world of collecting. He's been coming around the shop a little bit lately with, with Uncle Yama. And uh, they're here today helping out with personal breaks. And uh, I said Jaden could sit down next to me. So everybody be sure to say what's up to Jaden over here, too. You guys say what's up to him. And we're going to have fun with ripping some boxes. Uh, Jeff says leather and lumber. So let's get right into leather and lumber for Jeff. This one I'm going to lean right there. These don't sit too well. There we go. Put that here. All right, here's how it goes. All right, Jeff, let's see what's up. Griffin Morris says, what's up, Jaden? There you go. There's another one. Rain8507 says, what's up? To can, me? Yeah, can you see that far? See right here, all these people. Wow. Kind of cool, huh? I didn't know that. 
think you're a good new customer. Now sit down with you. Let's see. Griffin Morris is from Sardis, Georgia. Rain8507 is from Brooklyn, New York. So those are people on the east coast of the country cool. that are saying what's up. Ethan says what's up. Miguel says what's up, Jaden. Oh. Caleb says what's up. Caleb. Wait, Caleb? Yeah, you probably don't know this Caleb. I know, I know this. You know a Caleb? Yeah. Like at school? This oh. Caleb is located in, I forget, I think he said earlier. Let me see. Uh, yeah, um, uh, Illinois. So he's far away. So he's in another is he state. Vanessa's mom? He's, Vanessa? No, he doesn't even live in California. Oh. That, that's where we live. This I thought you were talking about Mike. All right, Jeff. Let's see what's up with this pack of leather and lumber for you. Here's Juan Soto on the top, followed by Matt Chapman, Wilson Ramos. Your hits are behind Corey Kluber. I'll try to save those for a second. Let's just put them right there. Check out some of your other die cuts, including Yelly. Ethan Rubio is asking, is Jaden a Dodgers fan at all? Are you a Dodger fan? <laughs> yeah, he's still he's still kind of learning teams and stuff like that, but he's a Dodger fan for sure. We're making sure that we're making sure he likes some Dodgers. I also like Giants. Yeah. <laughs> he said he also likes the Giants. We're gonna have to change that, okay, oh, buddy? You, can't, you gotta get off of there. There's Barry Larkin for you, Jeff, and Cody Bellinger not whole gang card. As well as a nice little Greg Maddox. Let's check out your hits from this box. I'm just gonna flip these around. Woo, there we go. Oh, wow. Eloy Jimenez, leather autograph, and look at that low number right there. Two out of five. Jeff, what's up? I forgot to ask you uh, which team, I think, did you say you're from Cincinnati? Are you a Reds fan? Let me look back. Yeah, you said Cincinnati. I'm guessing you're a Reds fan. But hopefully you can live with this uh, it's nice two out of five Eloy. Yeah, Jeff says Reds. That's pretty sick right there. I'll get a sleeve on that in a second. Behind him, you got uh, Triple Bat Relic. Minnesota's Max Kepler right there. Not bad for a little one-off pack of some leather and lumber, Jeff. Again, we appreciate you uh, being patient as we are out of town and weren't able to execute personals last Monday. But hopefully, this is worth the wait right here. That's a sick two out of five Eloy. Soup says, that's sweet. Rain8507 says, Jaden bringing some of that pack luck with him. He says, you're good luck. This is a nice card right here. You see that? This card is signed got by the player. I got like, and it's numbered two out of five. Do you see that number right there? That means there's only five of these cards in the world. Kind of cool, five? huh? Yeah, awesome. Kind of cool. I got of a you did? You got a cracked ice from a football product? Yeah, it's put the jersey. That's cool. So let me uh, put these to the side, Jeff, and we'll hit up your box of archives. Another quick rep. <clears throat> Let's see what's up with archives. Rookie Collection says, not a bad way to start the break off. I agree. All right, Jeff, quick rip right here. You got one encased buyback autograph right underneath the lid. Uh, let's see who it's going to be. Could it be a Reds card? Ooh, no, it's a red helmet, though. But it's Yachty. Not bad. Yachty or Molina, great player. Three out of 30 on the autograph right there. Numbered on the left, signed on the right. This looks like, what, last year's Topps design, I want to say. 2017. 2017 Topps right here. Update series. One of the All-Star Game cards. That's been stamped with the Topps Archives logo. It's been signed by Yachty. Topps Factory sealed right here. And now, coming out to you, Jeff, out in Cincinnati. That's not bad. Not bad for a little one-off of the Archives. Jeff says, nice. So Awesome. Those will be coming out to you soon later this week, Jeff. Appreciate your support, man. Thanks for tuning in. I'm glad you're here live. That's a lot of fun. Uh, coming up next, we've got Bill B. Man. 
That's going to... Bill B. with a full box of Topps, Allen, and Ginter coming up right now. I wonder if... Uh, I wonder if Bill is watching right now. Is Bill B. watching right now? I'm going to get into the box for Bill B., who's at bat right now. On deck is Richard M. with a fine box of Panini and Case basketball. Getting closer to the basketball season. And uh, we need some help after that, folks. We're looking to you guys, the viewers right now, to jump in and grab something from our personal breaks pages. Let me just drop the link to that again right now. Click that link that we just dropped right there. That'll take you to our personal breaks pages. Choose any product on those five pages that say personal breaks in the title. And you will get that box open for you right now. Plus, free shipping for all personal breaks. Let's check out Bill B. Bill Bars, there he is. He said, yes, sir. All right, you're ready. Right on. Bill, tell us... Uh, Tell us your favorite team and your favorite player on that team as we get into your box. What's up, Jason Wento? Can't stay long, just want to stop in and say hi. Hit that like button. That's right. Hit that thumbs up, that like button, folks. We have a personal challenge to see how many likes we can get during our live streams. Bill is a Red Sox fan, so he's looking for anything Boston. Here's your box topper card. Let's just check that out. One N43 box topper. Could be signed. Signed ones are hard to find. Man, if this was signed right now, that would be sick. Tis not. But it's still a box loader card of the best player in baseball right there. Uh, let me just start getting out these packs here. All right, Bill, where do you want me to go first? Stack one, stack two, or stack three, Bill? This one's up to you. Your box, your pick. <clears throat> one, three, two. One, three, so we'll move three over, and then two. So it's going to be like that. Let's check it out. Three hits per box on the Allen and Ginter. Maybe potentially bonus. We have seen bonuses. Here's Flaherty. Here's the Cespedes Family Barbecue card. Robinson. Trinan. Merrifield on the Mini. Uh, we got an Airplane card there. We got Mr. Matt Kemp. And Max Scherzer. That gets pack number one. Is that cool? Good stuff, huh? Wait till you see some of the hits. Hopefully we get some cool hits out of this box. All right, here's Ryan Braun. Severino. There's a Yankees card right there, a small one, Miguel Andahar. Jaden was whispering Yankees over my back shoulder right now, and then that pops out. Mark Summers there from Double Dare. Jake Arrieta. Carlos Correa. Ted Williams, there's a little Boston love for you, Bill. And Martinette. You got a lot of packs. Soup just dropped the link to our, our personal breaks pages. Once again, you can click that link if you like. Get right to our personal breaks pages. Choose any product with the words personal break in the title. We'll rip it for you right now. And uh, we'll even pay the shipping. We'll ship off all the cards to you. You can watch it go down right here and now. And then you can uh, get your hands on the cards later in the week when they come in the mail. It's like a double whammy, double surprise. You get to see your box open right now. And then you get something cool in the mail. Which, I always like getting mail. It's always fun to get mail, even if you know what's coming. Here's Derek Jeter. Hamels. Burnett. Buxton. Osuna. These uh, Mares and Stallions cards. Quinn and Martinez rounding out that pack. Uh, 
Here's Al Faro. Uh, Ted Williams again. Hader. Gooden. The Doc. Another airplane card. We got a mini of Fergie Jenkins. That's right. Castro and Mariano Rivera rounding out that pack. <clears throat> Rodriguez, Nola, Pastrana, Tanaka. Here's a yellow Labrador that's jumping all over the place. Ty Cobb, Corey Seager, Noah Syndergaard. Somebody says, hi, it's Dylan. I bought some grab bags, I'm assuming from our shop, and pulled a die cut sticker auto out of 50. That's cool. Congratulations. People love the grab bags over here at Hall of Fame. <clears throat> AJ Andrews here. Who's this guy? This guy is a professional poker player, John Sin. There's Sandy Koufax, Whit Merrifield, Michael Conforto. I think there's a hit behind Koufax. Sure enough, it's the kid with the cool hair. Ben Schwartz, actor and comedian. Relic card right there. So that's your first hit. Just a little black little t-shirt swatch or something there. Ben Schwartz, first relic for you, Bill. <laughs> John Sin. Can't be a real name. That's funny. It didn't, it didn't really connect with me until right now. Speaking of, here's Randy John Sin. <laughs> How about the timing on that joke? Here's Santa's sleigh. There is a mini of uh, tr the yard goat train chugging along. Griffey Jr. and Oz. All right, that's stack number one. Here's stack number three for you, Bill. Mookie Betts, Price, a couple of Boston cards right off top there. There's Miyati, Chapman, a little mini of Shohei. Ozzy Smith here, Sheffield and Mercer. <laughs> Soup with the trumpet. Womp, 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 womp. Guriel Jr., Banks. Bonomo, Astudio, Machado, Bagwell, Guerrero, Crawford. Moncada, Ripken, Colby, Turner, Black Labrador. We saw yellow earlier. Scythe, Bob Feller, and Torres right there rounding out that pack. Someone's asking, when's there going to be another shop vlog? Uh, I've been so busy lately that I haven't even had any time to film any additional material like shop vlogs, though I would love to. I'm supposed to be getting something real cool in the mail pretty soon if it hasn't come already. I haven't even had a chance to check my, uh, my mail at home because I've been gone so often. It's probably stacking up in there, but... Hopefully, if that comes in the mail, I can film something sooner than later. Nice little, at least a mail day or something. Here's LeMayhew and Machado. There's Oliva. 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 Allen. Yount. Yastrzemski. Another red sock. What's up, Andrew V? There's Granky. There's Brett. Jaden, what's your favorite sport? My favorite sport is football and... Um, baseball. Football and baseball? Do you know any football teams? Football teams. Like, can you name any football teams, maybe? Eagles. Eagles. That's a football team. Yeah, they're out of Philadelphia. And um, Patriots. Patriots are out of New England. And USC. USC does have a football team. Yep, yep. And 
Have you? Do you know any football teams here in LA and Los Angeles? Have you heard of the Rams? Rams. The Rams, the Chargers. Do you know the Chargers? Have you heard of them? Yeah. All right, here behind Acuna, there's a little framed something. Let's see who it's going to be. Bill, some uh, Milwaukee. So it's going to be a sports player, which I prefer. Oh, yeah, there we go. Boom, Josh Hader. Throws a heater, that's for sure. There you go, a little framed mini auto. Of one of the best arms in the game. <clears throat> Not a red sock, but still a cool card. Wento says, Haterade. What's up, James M? James says, hey, shop. Andrew V says, who's the guest? Andrew, this is uh, Yama's nephew, Jaden. Say what's up to Jaden, Andrew. Andrew's watching right here. He hey, comes Andrew. into our shop on occasion. Jaden says hello, Andrew. And Bill, there's a nice Josh Hader autograph for you. You got one more hit to be found out of this box. There you go. Andrew says, hey, Jaden. You see that? How do you spell your name? J-A-I-D-E-N. J-A-I-D-E-N for the official spelling. I didn't know that. Plenty of ways to spell Jaden, but it's J-A-I-D-E-N. That's cool. Henderson, Donaldson here. This is my favorite player right here on this card. That's Ricky Henderson, cool. my favorite player. Uh, there's Chance Adams, Mike Piazza, Casey Stengel. Hicks and Soto rounding out that pack. Uh, let's see, Rookie Collection asking if there's HOFBC merch online. Yes, there is. On our home page, if you just scroll down a little lower on the home page, we do have some t-shirts available for you to pick up. Join the club. Grab an HOFBC uh, shirt. Mike Brown says, what's up, Jaden? Hi, Mike Brown. Ethan says, you guys should have grab bags online. It's something we've thought about. We may make something available during the holidays. We'll see. Maybe a little test run. Definitely in consideration. Patrick Mattern says, I'm addicted to your breaks now. Patrick M., I feel like, I, my, I don't remember exactly, but I think you were in Saturday's break or Friday's. I don't remember, but I feel like you did pretty well. There's a George Brett Mini. There's a Wade Boggs with the mustache. Rain8507 says, he has a son named Jaden, and he spells it J-A-Y-D-E-N. Can you read that far? Can you see any of those? A little bit? Halliday, Palka, Ott, Cabrera. What's up, Logan? Logan says, hey, card shop, Eric. What's up, buddy? Patrick had the Cardinals on Saturday. Cool. You got some hits out of there, I believe. Yeah, you didn't come back. Remember, we were saying that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. You took off early, didn't you, Patrick? You took off early. I told you to stick around for uh, Immaculate. That's right. And you took off early. And you got two sick hits out of that box. I hope you went back and watched that video. He says I was at a Rays game. Well, that's cool. That's that's cool, too. But you got some couple of nice hits, for sure. Those were already in the mail, by the way. Here's uh, Diaz, Muncy, Acuna, Kluber, Mini. Rod Carew. I think there's a hit behind Rod Carew. Uh, behind Rod Carew, Albert Almora is the third, perhaps not final hit. It's only supposed to be three hits per box, but you never know. There could be another one. But for now, this is potentially your third hit. Albert Almora Relic. It's a genuine Topps Allen and Ginter Relic card that features memorabilia from Albert Almora, star outfielder of the Chicago Cubs. Here's Anderson, Marshall, Jackson, Yusei Kikuchi on the mini, Schwarber, Stallions, Otani, and Helton. Patrick joined our trading group as well. Cool, cool. K 
Kiermaier, Vanerchuk, Valdez, Rizzo. Little black border mini parallel of uh, Hank Aaron right there. Cool little card. Thor's hammer. Have you ever seen any of the uh, Avengers movies? Yeah, what's your favorite Avenger? My favorite Avenger is the Hulk. The Hulk. The Hulk is Jaden's favorite Avenger. Let's make that a conversation right now. What about you guys? What's your favorite Avengers character? What's mine? I think I'm going to go with... I do like the Hulk, but I really like Iron Man, too. Iron Man's pretty cool. Patrick's asking me to shout out his cousin Isaac. No problem for you, Patrick. What's up, Isaac? Thanks for being a fan of the channel. Thanks for watching. I hope you're doing well out there. Let's see, going back to Marvel characters. Andrew and Logan say Spider-Man. Patrick likes Quicksilver. Wento likes Black Widow. Here's Corbin, Killebrew, Boar, Hodges, Hornsby. Lost Languages Mini, Michael Kopeck and Brantley. Three packs left for Bill. <clears throat> yeah, Wento says Spidey's out of the club. Marvel, what is it? Marvel C MCU, Marvel Cinematic Universe or something? Big Jacob likes the Black Panther. Kaysen likes Vision. Cool, cool, cool choices. Not some of the obvious choices that I thought I was going to hear, so that's cool. Claiborne, Goldschmidt, Altuve, Lindor, Abreu. I didn't used to like Thor as much when his, uh, his solo movies first came out, but after watching that last Avengers Endgame and just the character he played with Thor, I really, I really grown to like Thor's character. Vasquez, Veritek, Castellanos, Robinson, Robles, Abreu on the mini, Mares and Stallions, and here's uh, Josh James, the man with two first names. So last pack for Bill, then we're moving on. Guriel, Bagwell, uh, Tiger Mask mini. Fred McGriff, the crime dog. <laughs> Archer, there's a nice airplane card. Have you, you like space shuttles? Not really. Not really. Look at that thing. How cool is that, though? It's kind of cool. If you got the chance to go up into space, would you? Yeah, maybe. Here's Matt Olson and Hank Aaron rounding out the pack for Bill. Not too shabby. Uh... Almora Relic, a Schwartz Relic, and then probably the big hit of the box was the Josh Hader framed mini auto. Bill, a little tip of the cap to you, my friend. Thanks for jumping in. Appreciate your support. I hope you enjoyed that little segment just for you, and we hope to see you again. Let me take a quick sip of water. Somebody's asking, where are the brakes? Soup, a.k.a. Luis Valdez, right there in the chat, just dropped a link. You can click that link in the group chat. It'll take you right to our Personal Breaks pages. Choose any product that has the words Personal Breaks in the title. You'll get it ripped right now live, and then we'll ship the cards right out to you. And we'd love to have you. Uh, we need to fill up the probably the last half of this, uh, this two-hour segment we got a box of Panini Encased Basketball for Richard M. Coming up right now on the at bat. Then we got some stuff lined up. Thanks to David BR. Nice to have you back. He got two boxes. Hot ones, too. Bowman Chrome, Tops Chrome for David BR. We got, ooh, James M. following suit with some Panini Encased Basketball. And Patrick, is that Patrick M that's in the chat in the chat right now? Got a box of pro debut, and there's still gonna be time for more boxes. If you guys want to get lined up and get yourselves in line for us to rip for you tonight, get those orders in now. 
Soup says, I'm okay, but I'll be better if y'all got into these breaks. That's my boy, Soup. Love you, my man. <clears throat> All right, Martinez, are you up in here right now? David says, what's up, C.S. Eric? I like that. It's kind of like C.S. Lewis. Like I'm a, like I'm a writer. C.S. Eric, how's it going? Going well, man. Good to have you back. James N. James M. says, let's get it. Good luck, everybody. Uh, everybody. Uh, Richard's here. He says, I'm here, buddy. Richard M. is Monrovia22 on YouTube. All right. Five cards per box. This should include one slabbed, graded, on-card autograph per box on average. Rookie jersey autographs numbered to 99. Delivery variety of parallels. Richard, you're not one to really get into basketball, at, at least historically, that I remember. I don't remember too well. What are you hoping to see out of here? Any specific teams or players? Soup says, I'm pumped to see this. Me too. So it opens up like this, just a little nice... Nice tight little lid there. There's one. I think that's the encased card that's wrapped up there. Let's see if I can get it out the box. There we go. And then there's an additional pack under here. Richard's looking for Lakers. I like that. Looking for the Lake Show. We're going to check out your encased. Actually, I'll let you choose, Richard. What do you want to see? You want to see the pack in my left hand, or do you want to see the encased card first in my right hand, Richard? That's a question for you as I take a sip of water. Give Richard a second. Oh. I know you're there. There he goes. He says, uh, P-A-K cars. I'm, I'm guessing that means, I'm guessing the pack. I'm guessing is what that means, pack. I'm just going to trust that that's what you mean. I'm going with this pack right here. Here we go. Let's check out Panini Encased. If I can get this pack open, we'll check it out. All right. Sick. Right on the front. How about Chris Mullen? Weren't we just talking about the mm -hmm. Olympic team? The Olympic team. Yeah. yeah. That's a sick card right there. 38 out of 49. Chris Mollick on-card autograph with a little swatch. All right, I'm sold. Panini encased. James M. says, pretty sick. I agree, man. That's a nice-looking card. Let me just get a quick sleeve on that. That's a good way to start, man. Chris Mullen was a baller for sure. The original Splash Bro. That's right, says Soup. What do you think about that one, Richard? I think that's a nice card, man. It's a very clean autograph. Very clean. Very nice. All right, your next card in the stack is Mo Bamba. Little thick pinstripe there. 15 out of 25. More Bamba is what that stands for. He wants more Bamba. <clears throat> what about everybody watching right now? What kind of basketball teams are y'all into? Drop your favorite NBA teams down right now. Let's talk a little basketball for a minute. Should be an interesting season, man. Lakers made some moves. Clippers made some moves. Zion, everybody's waiting to see what he's going to be. Next card for Richard is uh, this guy. <laughs> Rodians. Rodians. Crux. I really, I just butchered that name probably. A little rookie material. 17 out of 99. Brooklyn Nets. Brooklyn Nets. <laughs> So let's see, we got uh, a bunch of people ch chanting Lakers up in here, a bunch of Lakers fans. Julie, L.E.L., Ethan all say Lakers. 
Uh, Noah says Milwaukee. Kaysen says not a big basketball guy, but Bulls all the way. Patrick likes Vandy. Uh, big Jacob likes Golden State. James likes the Grizzlies. Patrick likes the Sixers in the NBA. Ethan likes Lakers. Brian S. likes the Sonics. Logan likes the Cavs. Good stuff. Let's see what else. Last card in the pack is uh, just a little numbered base card. Al Horford, 64 out of 99. That Chris Mullen was sick, though. And you still have an encased card to look at. Let's check that out right now. Here you go, Richard. Keep your eyes open. Factory encased. Yama's coming out to see what's happening. Lean, lean over. Say hi to everybody. The infamous card shop Yama. What's up? His real name is Chris, but uh, we call him Yama. Just a little nickname. All right. Looks like you got a rookie. It says rookie right there for sure. Here we go. Michael Bridges. 34 out of 75, graded by Beckett to be a nine and a half. Nice on-card autograph with a little inscribed number 25 right there. Phoenix Suns. So maybe not the Laker you were hoping for, Richard, but getting a Beckett 9.5 is not bad any day. Any day. A little close-up of the signature. Decent little signature. It looks like he signed it pretty clean. There you go. The autograph has been graded a 10. There it is, right in the top left. So according to Beckett, that's as good as his autographs get right there. 2018-19 Panini encased. Michael Bridges. Rookie Auto. There you go, Richard. I hope you enjoyed that little quick rip. I, I certainly enjoyed getting into some basketball real quick, and this is a nice product. We got another box coming up for James M. Late, uh, later. Can't wait to see what might be in store for that. Sincere thank you to your Richard for your continued support, buddy. Richard's been a longtime supporter of ours. Long, long time. Grew up, went to school with my uncle back in the day here in Monrovia. He's been around. Thanks, buddy. Quick sip of water. And uh, now batting, David B.R. with two fine boxes right here. On deck, James M. with Panini Encased. And in the hole, Patrick M. with Pro Debut. And then we need to fill up the rest of our lineup. Who wants to bat cleanup now? If you want us to rip a box of cards for you live on this program today, right now, get in line. Get those orders in. See if I can, uh, there we go, dropping the link. I just dropped the link into the group chat. Click that link. It'll take you to our group breaks pages. Choose any product that says personal breaks in the title. Order it right now. We'll open it for you right now. We'll pack it up and we'll ship it off to you. You'll get it later this week. So it's fun. You get to see it now. Then you get to get it in the mail, a little present in the mail. Fill in the end of that lineup, folks. David BR, where you at, buddy? You still in here? You want me to open one of these two boxes first for you? What do you want, Bowman Chrome or Topps Chrome Jumbo? If you're still in here, I'll give you a second to, to reply. So I wait, because usually uh, he's watching. See, there he is, David BR. That's this gentleman right here, David Brigham. See him? See his name right there? So I asked him, so I'm able to talk to him. He's watching on his computer or his phone at home or whatever. And I say, hey, which box? Because he, he purchased these boxes, so they're his. I'm going to open them up for him. So I always said, which one do you want to start with? He says, Bowman Chrome is a good to start. Big hits. All right. All right. Ask and ye shall receive, David. We got little Jaden here watching. And Bowman Chrome's a brand new product on the market. And these cards look hot. I love the box design. Really good work on the box design. I love the coloration. Got Alonzo and Tatis. Couple of big rookies this season. Tatis got hurt, of course. But he's got so much future potential. Alonzo, probably guaranteed rookie of the year. Mm -hmm. 
Bowman is heavily prospective, which means there's a lot of prospect rookies and autos. Maybe some names we don't know yet. But that doesn't mean they won't be known in the future, and that's the thing. Always hang on to your Bowman Chrome rookies and autos. What could be a $10 auto today might be a $1,000 auto next season. You never know. Rookie Collection says, good to see you informing the youth about the hobby. Love it, man. Hey, thanks, dude. Uh, we do our best. You know, this, is, this business has literally been in my family my entire life. I've been around it my whole life. I've seen the ins and the outs. And uh, it's always been run as a family business. And um, it's just uh, super important. I don't have any kids of my own, but it's super important to us to still keep the family aspect of it. Um, and yeah, kids are a big part of what we do here. All right, David. Let's check it out. If you don't mind, I'm just going to start with this stack right here. <clears throat> Sixto Sanchez for Miami. Logan Gilbert. Blake Snell. These cards look great. Mookie Betts. And Rowdy Tellez. By the way, Soup, I just remembered I still owe you a pack of Panini Prism. Wasn't it Panini Prism? Soup, we did the we did the numbered card challenge last weekend, and Soup happened to guess the number correctly. The card was numbered one out of a hundred or whatever it was. Here's Hansel Moreno. You want me to open your pack live, Soup? Is that what you're saying right now? Hans Kraus. Ryan Weathers. Luis Urias. And Jake Bowers. No autograph yet. Brian Abreu. Yeah, we can do that, Soup. No problem. Here's uh, Duran Duran right there. Ooh, we got a nice and blue color behind him. Hopefully an auto. Whit Merrifield, Eloy Jimenez, rookie. Let's see, behind Duran Duran. Texas Rangers, first Bowman card. Is it going to be a first Bowman auto? Yes, Eli White. Eli White, blue refractor on card auto. First Bowman auto for Mr. White here, numbered 47 out of 150. What do y'all know about Eli White? See you later, Wento. Have a good night, buddy. <clears throat> That's a nice looking card. I love it when the autograph pen color and the border and the uniforms all kind of match. Blue on blue on blue. Here you go, David. That's your first one. But definitely not your last. Here's Nick Green, Yamamoto, we got Del Rosario, Manny Machado, and Reese Hoskins. David says super clean looking. Yeah, these cards are super clean looking. There's Tim Tebow, though I don't think he has any autographs in the checklist. I wish he did. People like collecting Tebow autographs. Uh, there's Grayson Rodriguez, Ronnie Mauricio, Acuna, and Trinan. Sanchez, Mackenzie Gore, good pitcher, youngster, Shed Long, Buster Posey, and Griffin Canning. All right, here we go, uh, David. Six packs in your next mini box. Try to predict the auto in the first, just one try. Pick a number there, David, or a couple numbers if you want to choose the order that I open these in. Let me get a quick sip of water. David says pack two. 
All right, let's see pack two. Aramis Adaman, Joey Bart. A lot of people looking for his autograph these days. Two, five, four is what you said. Two, three, four, five, four. So we'll do it like that. Here's five and then four. Uh, Adaman, Joey Bart, Kyle Wright, numbered out of 499. Casey Mize, stat tracker insert. Astudio. All right, here's pack five. Garrett Whitlock, Nolan Jones, Ronaldo Hernandez, stat tracker. Vlad Jr., rookie. Looking good on the Bowman Chrome, by the way. And Billy Hamilton, that was pack five. Let's check out pack four. Mike Ciani, Leonardo Jimenez, something purple behind him, hopefully signed. There's Brian Anderson, Justin Turner. Let's see what this purple card here is. Looks like an Angels pitcher. First Bowman card. Who do we think it is? Not autographed. It's Patrick Sandoval. The purple shimmers are not numbered. Definitely look cool, though. Well, you whiffed right there, David. What do you think? Any particular order for these last three? You should have an autograph in these last three. <clears throat> Unless there was a mistake in the operation. Caleb says, I got to go, Eric. Have a good night, everyone. See ya, buddy. I'm not sure if David wants to pick order on these, so I'm just going to go with this one right here. Let's see. This would have been the top pack. Number one. Let's see. Nick Prado. Oh, you said one, two, three. Perfect. Nick Prado. Ryan Rollison. Victor. Victor Mesa. The other man with two first names, literally. Uh, Michael Kopech, rookie. Cedric Mullins. So pack one, no doing. Pack two. Uh, Briam Camposano. Owen Miller. Maybe an auto behind him. There's Yon Moncada. There's Jose Altuve. Let's see if this is an auto. Yes, Cam Regner is how I'm pronouncing that last name because I don't am not familiar with that. Regner? Rogner? That appears to be your second auto there. First Bowman auto, and not too shabby. He did a pretty good job for his first Bowman auto. Your final pack. Mitchell White. <laughs> Rogner? <laughs> Rogner? Don't even know her. Uh, Alec Bohm, there's uh, Darwinson Hernandez, Arizona Fall League, Castellanos, and Ronald Guzman. So that's going to do it for your Bowman Chrome box. Rogner and Eli White, Blue Parallel. But don't go anywhere, David. As you know, you have a box of Topps Chrome Jumbizzle coming up right now. Followed by James M, who is on deck. Patrick M is in the hole. And then we still need to fill up the last half of our lineup. Folks, we'd love you to jump in. Let's get some personal breaks going. We still got over an hour left on this live stream. And three boxes ain't going to cut it. Jump into personal breaks right now. I'm going to drop the link right now. There's the link. Soup dropped it as well. It's like we're reading each other's minds. Drop that link. Choose any product that says personal breaks. Purchase that. You'll get free shipping. We'll rip it for you right now. Then we'll ship you all the cards that you see. All right. What do you think, David? Left or right? 
Left or right, David BR? Left stack or right stack, or do you care? Patrick says, I'm going to see if I have enough money to get archives. Well, all right, you're thinking about it. I like that. David says, all you on this box, brother. Okay. Uh, I'm going to go right. And I'm going to start from the bottom. Just because. Change it up a little. Five chrome autographs per box on the Topps Chrome Jumbos. Can't go wrong with Topps Chrome. Can you, folks? Come on. Kyle Hendricks. Aaron Sanchez. <clears throat> Chris Sale, Josh Rogers, Jesus Aguilar, Cedric Mullins, Francisco Lindor. That's purple, by the way. I think there might be an autograph behind the purple card, too, which is fun. Uh, Franco, Laureano, Peralta, Giolito, and Urias behind... So you got a nice purple Lindor and your autograph. Woo! Tatis Jr. may have suffered a little bit of an injury that kept him out the last half of the season, but still very collectible, very desirable by a lot of people. Hopefully, David, you're into that. Hopefully, you're into that. David says, big hit. Everyone else, money. Oh, snap. Boom. Sick. Called it. Been looking for a Tatis Auto all season. There you go, buddy. Well, happy to pull this for you for sure. There it is. Nice old... A base rookie auto. I haven't seen too many of his autos, to be honest. Does he sign usually like that with the little lines? Still cool. You got one, man. That's a nice hit, buddy. Congrats, bud. Thanks, David. Sick. And that's only the first pack. <laughs> that is only the first pack. Lindor, by the way, is numbered 114 out of 299. Sickness. Look, Soup says, looks like he signed it with his injured back. Maybe he did sign it laying down or something. All right. Second pack out of the box. Ryan O'Hearn. Dylan Bundy. Simmons. Martinez. Abreu. Blackman. A couple cards behind him. Let's go Andahar. Kershaw. By the way, that was the first pack we opened up right here, but it happened to be the last pack because I flipped over that stack. Remember, that would have been the last pack in the box. There's Kershaw, Anderson, Story, and Matt Olson. Let's see what's behind Blackman. Uh, we got a little Jake Bowers freshman flash rookie and... Steven Duggar, Prism Rookie. Josh James, uh, Patrick Corbin, Corbin Burns. How many times this season have we seen these two guys back to back? And I do my little Wheel of Fortune thing, the before and after. Patrick Corbin Burns. Uh, Trey Mancini, Pete Alonzo, rookie, base. Paul DeYoung, Rizzo. Rodriguez, potential autograph behind him. There's Polanco, Chapman, Andrews, and Martinez. Let's see what's behind Rodriguez. A's. Ramon Laureano rookie autograph. He's a good player, man. That's not a bad little rookie autograph. So nice. That's a 
two packs, three packs, two autographs, I think. And a couple of good ones so far. David says, sick, huge Loriano fan. Right on, man. Me too. Why not? I want to see the A's come up, man. I definitely would like to see the A's come up. Maybe he can help do that. I got a good little, solid little team. I don't know. Let's see. Here's Hoskins, Walker, Buxton, Boyd. Anyone remember Oil Can Boyd from back in the 80s? I'm sure Soup does. Probably a couple other guys. Oil Can Boyd. No relation to Matt Boyd. Uh, here's Posey, Whit Merrifield, Schwarber, Losiga, Ramirez, and Arcia. Uh, Merrifield, Santana, Prism, Gleyber Torres, and Derek Jeter on the same card. And then there's the uh, Eddie Rosario. Andrew V says, can I buy a pack of archive signatures, have it open on stream, even though it's not one of the personal breaks options? It should be a personal break. Uh, Yama, are we sold out of uh, archive signature series on personals? Let me get back to you in a second there, Andrew. We're checking on that. I think we have enough to maybe restock them for personals right now if we can. No, we're fine. Is it stocked? Yeah. It's stocked. It should be all stocked up there, Andrew. Uh, Soup says, Oil Can used to brush his teeth every inning when he pitched. What do you mean? Like, in between innings, he'd be in the dugout brushing his teeth? Are you serious about that? Uh, here's Tommy Pham, Guriel Jr., Colin Moran, Colonel Perez, Taylor Ward, Lewis Brinson, Whit Merrifield, something blue behind him, which could be cool, Colby Allard, Mondesi, Molina, Upton, and Duffy. Let's see what's behind Whit Merrifield. Something blue, Manaya. Blue parallel, so a little Oakland Athletics talk earlier called uh, Sean Manaya out here, numbered 57 out of 150. What's up, Cam Vett? Sorry I'm late, had homework to finish. Hopefully you got your homework done, buddy. All right, here's Verlander. We're still looking for three more autos out of this box. Smoke, Hamilton, Polanco, Arcia, Astudio, Glaber, uh, Trey Turner. Something behind him. We got Pilar, Bueller. Bueller kind of struggled the other night, unfortunately. But I think, uh, did we come back to win that game, or was that the game we lost? I don't remember. Jose Barrios and Starlin Castro behind the Trey Turner prism. Is something purple? Is it signed? Kevin Kramer. Purple refractor on card rookie autograph. That's pretty. I like the color scheme there with the, the gold, black, and the purple. I actually think that looks really cool in person. And a pretty clean signature. Yeah, decent box so far. Number 22 out of 250 for you, David. Patrick says he's watching this while re-watching Stranger Things and doing homework at the same time. I don't know how you can do that. I would get too easily distracted by everything. Uh, that worked out pretty well. Let's go from the bottom of this stack, too, David. Let's do it. Two more autos. Goldie on the front. Dwell Lugo. Will Myers. Danny Jansen. Trey Turner, Michael Kopech, Kyle Wright, Yelly, doesn't look like we're going to find an autograph here, Hosmer, McNeil, Severino, and Dietz. Uh, no, I did not see your explanation. Let's see, there's a baseball card where they captured him brushing, and it had that fun fact on the back of the card. Interesting. Brushing his teeth in between innings. Oil can boy. He threw some junk for sure. <clears throat> K 
Cam Vet, our, our neighbor has not shown up, but our neighbor's neighbor showed up a little earlier, and this guy right here. It was nice to see that. And we still got two more autos out of this box. There's Don, De Leon, Turner, Santana, Duggar, Judge, Ponce De Leon. Looks like we're going to have uh, something behind the Dewell Lugo prism. Dakota Hudson, Stroman, Suarez. This guy is at the top of the home run heap right now. Michael Givens and Zach Cozart. Let's see what's hiding behind Lugo. Looks like a catcher's mask. I believe we've seen this guy already. Is this the guy from Miami? Or is it Tampa Bay? Yeah, Tampa Bay. Nicholas Siufo is how I'm pronouncing it. Decent signature. Swoopy but clean. On-card rookie autograph, Tampa Bay. All right, that's four out of five autographs for you, David. Let's see, we got four packs left. I'm just going to keep going down the back side of this stack here. Jesus Aguilar, Evan Longoria, Sheffield, Birdie, Guzman, Guzman. Two Ronald Guzmans back-to-back. -back. That's interesting. One of them's got to be a refractor or something. No, they both look like base cards. Weird. Don't see that too often. Uh, Jake Bowers here. We got uh, Falefa. We got ooh soup. Here's your boy right here on a nice gold version card. Nolan Arenado. The Dodger game I went to on Friday night. He had a sick play at third base where he completely laid out over the bag in the air and just flopped down hard. I think that was Friday night's game. He wasn't able to make the throw to first too well, but it was a sick stop. Nice looking gold card. Numbered 13 out of 50. That's right. Yeah, Benny's dad caught his home run on the fly. That's right. It was funny. I tried to hit up Benny during the game. I texted him because I knew he was there. And it was like the fourth inning, and he said he already left. I'm assuming he probably gets there early for to shag fly balls and stuff and then probably leaves early. He goes to so many games. But I was hoping to have met up with him for at least a, a, a few minutes, maybe grab a beer or something, but didn't happen. Nice little gold Arenado there, David, though. Nice card. Brinson. Merrifield, DeYoung, Blackman, Eloy, Birdie, Goldie, uh, Renfro, Bryant, Perez, and Kramer. I'm thinking there's possibly an autograph back here. I do see some white right here on the on the card. Let's see. If it's autographed, it's going to be a Kansas City Royal rookie. What do you guys think? Let's see if it's signed. Yes, it is. Mr. O'Hearn. Hello, Ryan O'Hearn. I've got the tiniest autograph in the world. It's so tiny. But it's clean. It's not. It's not the size of the signature. It's how you sign it. <clears throat> yes, Andrew says, I made the purchase, didn't know the page for breaks, went on to more pages. Yes, there's five different pages of personal breaks. So when you click that link, that'll take you to the front page of personal breaks, but then you'll scroll to the bottom of that, and then there's like five different tabs you can click on. There's five different pages of personal break material, folks. Be sure to check out all those pages by clicking that link. Kaysen says, do not do the Scottish joke. <laughs> I won't. This one's numbered 193 out of 499 for you, David. You still got two more packs. Scott. 
rookie collection wants me to do the rest of the break in the Irish voice. Syndergaard, Kyle Wright, Seeger, Cabrera, Astudio, Sheffield, Glaber, Colby Allard, Kopech, uh, Bauer, Cano, Stewart, and Adams. Final pack for David BR tonight, unless he jumps in with something else. But for now, Joey Rickard, Jose Altuve, Arenado again. Here's JP Crawford, Cedric Mullins, Evan Longoria, Austin Meadows, future stars, uh, Aaron Judge on the prism. That's cool. Uh, Jacob DeGrom. Blake Snell, Josh Hader, Max Scherzer, and Jake Cave. So not a bad little box for you there, David B.R. Ryan O'Hearn autograph, Siufo, of course, Tatis Jr., Kevin Kramer, Purple, and Ramon Laureano. I think those were the big three, really. Decent little box there. Appreciate you, David. Thank you so much for your continued support. He says, solid box. Thanks, Shop. You got it, buddy. One of these days, you got to come on up, maybe on like a Friday or something, if you can get a Friday off, or maybe a Saturday after after the shop or something. Let's go grab a, grab a bite and a beer or something, maybe. <clears throat> All right. Now batting. James M. with his own box of Panini encased basketball on deck. That puts Patrick M. on deck. Uh, Andrew V. jumped in with a uh, quick rip of some archives. And then we're going to have still plenty, plenty of time left for anyone else who wants to jump in and have us rip a box for you on this episode tonight. Click that link. We've been dropping it all night. Soup just dropped it again, twice. Dropping the deuce, dropping it three times. Huh. Can I get it four times? Give it to me. <laughs> uh, yeah, click that link. Choose any product that says personal breaks in the title. There's five pages of personal breaks uh, products. <clears throat> in fact, look, I'll show you. I can go to, the, go to our website. Watch this. Follow me. Here's our website right here. This is page one. If you were to scroll all the way to the bottom of that, and then look, these tabs down here. One, two, click three, four, five. Look at that, all these products that are available for personals. Limited quantities on some of these. But all these products, and you get free shipping on all of them. Free shipping for personal break products. Who's going to pull the trigger on this lonely box of 2019 definitive right here? But yeah, those links will take you to those five pages. Go get some personal breaks. You'll be up soon because we got some quick, a couple of quick rips here. James M., you in? James M. James M. says, let's go with the encased card first. He knew what I was going to ask. All right, buddy. Almost pinched my finger there. Brian says, Brian H says, how quick do these ship? Maybe I will jump in and break some absolute. Yeah, we're gonna ship these cards out tomorrow. So they'll be they'll be in the mail tomorrow afternoon. That's how quick. Next day on personals. All right, James M. with Panini and Case Basketball. Hi there. Got some people coming in the front door. Yes, he is. We're live on YouTube right now. What's up, folks? Hi, I'm from New York. <laughs> we got some people from New York coming in to visit today. All right, James, this one's for you. You want to check out the encased card first. Let's see what's up. And Brian Holmes says, dang, that's awesome. Here I come. Right on. We're looking forward to seeing your name up in here, Brian. All right, James. Encased. Some kind of a rookie. I see the same similar back there. Rookie. Uh, who do you hope it is, James? Which team do you want? Or player? 
Let's try to, let's try to, I don't know, let's try to wish it. Let's try to make it happen. I'm going to take a sip of water real quick. <clears throat> Zion is not in this product. He wasn't in this product yet when they released it. But potential Luca for sure. Let's just see. I'm not seeing James' response right now, so I'm just going to get into it. Hopefully you like what's coming out. Hopefully, if you don't like it, maybe someone else you can trade for it or something like that. But, James M., you got Afrony Simmons right here. Another Beckett nine and a half. With a 10 auto. 10 graded auto right here. Portland Trail Blazers. And according to Beckett, that's as good as his autograph gets right there. Right there. <clears throat> Always good to see a 9.5 grade from Beckett, though. Super hard to get 10s from Beckett, so 9.5 is... It's pretty good. James M. says, not bad. It's numbered, by the way, 27 out of 75 right there up by my thumb. 27 out of 75. So, yeah, if you don't, uh, if you don't appreciate, if you don't, uh, not interested in this card, maybe you can trade. We do have a trading group. Anybody who's watching right now, listen up. You can go to Facebook, search Facebook for HOFBC Trading Group, and request to join. It's all ages. It's free to join. It's strictly for trading, no sales, no self-promotion, just pure form of the hobby through trading. Great way to get to know people and to get rid of cards you maybe don't want and get cards you do want. Oh, look, Soup found the link, actually. Soup found the link to uh, the Hall of Fame trading group, I guess. Thanks, buddy. So you can click that link that's, that Luis Valdez is dropping in the group chat. That'll get you our... Uh, Trading group, request to join. We'll let you in as soon as we get a chance. All right, James M., here's your pack from the Panini in case. We saw a nice Chris Mullen auto. Let's see what's coming out of here. First auto, Sean Elliott. 24 out of 25. Nice little, looks like a um, red parallel. On-card auto. San Antonio Spurs. My folks in San Antonio know what good salsa should taste like. Where's this stuff made? New York City. New York City. Get a rope. If you're if you know what I'm talking about, then you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> uh, let's see. Coming up next. Ooh, Giannis. Sick little patch there. Two out of 25. I'm not even going to try to pronounce his last name. Sick little patch. Three breaks on it. Two out of 25. I'm actually going to sleeve these as I go here. Sleeve up Mr. Elliott. Sleeve up Yanni. And behind this card, we see Blake Griffin, 13 out of 99, jersey card right there. And Graham Drogic, Drogic. So that's going to do it for your box of encased. Griffin, Giannis, Sean Elliott, and Simons. Preston asking a question. How do you know you're not going to get scammed through the trading thing? You don't know. It works on trust. You try it once with somebody, maybe try a smaller trade just to make sure that they're going to be honest, then maybe work up. I wouldn't trade a million-dollar card with someone you don't know. That's just common sense. Start small with people, build trust, 
And over the months and years that you build trust with people, you get to know them, and then you can make bolder trades with those people. But I certainly would not trade anything super incredibly valuable first off. Start easy on trading. It's no big deal. Uh, by the way, thank you, James, for jumping in with that box of encased, man. Appreciate your continued support, buddy. Now batting, uh, Patrick M. with a box of Topps Pro Debut Baseball. Don't trade with anyone named Luis Valdez. He, he offers you bicycles for card shops. That's not a very fair trade. See, I just, I wouldn't do that. Not a good trade for me. <laughs> uh, let's see. Here we go. Is Patrick M. still watching? Yes, he is. He says, let's get it. All right, Patrick. Let's get it indeed. Patrick, what kind of minor league teams do you like? I see a lot of minor league cards in here. What are you into? <clears throat> and do you care which stack? Uh, he says, I'm a Rail Riders fan, Yankees AAA, since I'm from Scranton. All right, but I'm hoping for a Mize Auto, 100%. Looking for Casey Mize, okay. Do you care which stack I, I start with, or do you want to pick the stack? Do the first stack, no problem. And then we got Andrew V after this, by the way, with this box that, oh, it might stand up. A lot of times these archive signatures boxes don't stand up properly, but. And then we got nothing after that. We got something else coming through? Ah, Brian H. pulled the trigger. All right. He's going to be in the hole right now. All right. Casey Mize is who we're hoping to find here. Oh, <laughs> right on the back of the first pack. Uh, congratulations. How about Will Benson? Lake County Captains, Fragments of the Farm is a piece of the banner used in Classic Park. And look, it's low numbered. Five out of ten. First pack, first hit. Congratulations. Yeah, that's cool. Five out of ten is not bad. And there was also a uh, Ryan Costello card in there as well. Let's continue on with stack number one here. What about anybody else watching right now? Anybody else want to chime in? You guys like minor league teams at all? Here's Jordan Alvarez right here. Be nice to pull one of his autos. Tim Kate. There's Royce Lewis. It'd be nice to see one of his autos. Darwins and Hernandez. Mason Martin. Roberto Ramos. It's cool to open a product like Pro Debut at the end of the year because you would know a lot more names by this time. You, you have seen maybe a lot more names that have come up. Phew! Royce Lewis, there's a Jordan Alvarez numbered card right here. Fresno Grizzlies. 89 of 99. That's cool. Love to see that signed. wonder where my man Raul is. Raul lives up in uh, Visalia near Fresno. I wonder if he knows if he's ever seen Jordan play with the Grizzlies. Let's see. <clears throat> Rookie Collection says, my local minor league team is the Southern Illinois Miners. James M. likes the Norfolk Tides. <clears throat> Daniel Lynch, Bryce Terang, Jason Schroeder, Jeremy Ironman, Hub City Hippos Knight, Leody Taveras, hey, hey, Luis Garcia, Ian Anderson, hey, 
Josh Stowers. Collectibles likes Toledo Mud Hens. Josh Stowers, Nick Senzel, Will Banfield, Favra, Bannon, Cortez. Let's see what's behind Banfield. Something backwards. Oh. Okay. Interesting. Two cards stuck together. Luke and Baker. And Seth Beer, the Luke and Baker is autographed. Seth Beer would have made a cool autograph too, but Luke and Baker is also cool. Well, there you go. There's your first autograph. I think it's what two autos, two relics in these boxes. So these are your first of two autos. Uh, let's see. Somebody has a question. Preston's asking, what's the name of that basketball box you opened? That was called Panini Encased Basketball, I believe. I believe we only had two available, but we might be able to make one more available. If you're seriously interested, let me know beforehand, Preston, and uh, we can put it up. Dylan Cease, Jordan Adams, Dane Dunning, Daniel Johnson. Montero, Grant Little, Joey Bart, and Lenny Torres. Drew Waters, cool, cool waters, waters. John Duplantier, Corey Ray. By the way, that's that song is a famous song. But it, it opens up a really good movie called uh, The Ballad of Buster Scruggs. It's on Netflix. It's made by the Coen brothers. It's a great little movie that features five or six little mini vignettes. It's really wonderful. And it opens up with that song, Cool Waters. Has anybody seen it? Ryan Weathers, Miguel Amaya, Wander Franco, Bubik. And Alec Bohm. <clears throat> Patrick says, if I get nothing good out of this, I'm getting archives. All right. Reggie Lawson, Grayson Rodriguez, Tommy Romero, McCormick Field. I haven't seen one of these yet. That's interesting. Kind of a cool little photo. Ben's Biz, McCormick Field. Franklin Perez, Sheldon Noose, Justin Dunn, Dalton Varsho. Rookie Collection asking if anyone's seen the Drack of All Trades documentary. Yes, have seen it. Hans Kruse, Will Smith. Something red behind Will Smith. Let's check out Ryan McKenna, Suarez, and Woods Richardson. We got uh, Owen Miller and then a red parallel behind Will Smith of Bo Naylor. I don't even know her. Red parallels are usually low numbered. Let's see how low. 10, nine of 10 to be exact. Nine of 10 for Mr. Naylor. I like the red parallel, that looks pretty dope. All right, which stack do you want next, Patrick? Left or right? Take a sip of water. Michael Heron's up in here. What's up, Heron? Still got some time to jump in if you want. Uh, let's see. Patrick says right. Okay, we're going with the right stack. By the way, this just in, Brian H. is currently in the hole with a box of Absolute Football. Right on. I like that product. We're ripping that for you in a little bit. Uh, here's Hernandez. Baez. Mackenzie Gore. Zoo Knight. Daz Cameron. Hey, Daz, give me a light. Tirsor Nalis. Casey Golden. Akil Badu, not the Mize, not the Casey we're looking for. We're looking for Casey Mize, Topps Pro debut. K 
Casey Mize. Colton Welker. Hernandez. Wilson. I like the name Izzy. Always makes me think of one of the original uh, guitar players for Guns N' Roses. Shane McClanahan. Kevin Smith. Grayson Janista. Brendan Rogers. Matias. Jazz Chisholm. Michael Heron reminding everybody to hit that thumbs up button. If you haven't already, hit that like button. We do have a personal challenge. We like to see how many likes we can get during a live stream. Just for fun. Grant Levine here. I've already hit the like button on my side. Our record, believe it or not, middle of the summer at some point, there was one break where we just had a ton of people watching for us. It was a ton, and we got 124 likes. That was cool. Thanks for hitting that thumbs up. Bo Bichette here. Joe Gray Jr. Durbin Feltman. Ronaldo Hernandez. There's Casey Mize. Come on. Be a signature somewhere in this box of his. Nick Schnell. Osiris Johnson and Mike Ciani. There he was. Do you want to see that a little bit longer? Just a base card. I didn't know if you want to look at the base card a little bit longer, but maybe you do. Maybe get some mojo. Just get used to seeing him on screen right now. Maybe that'll help. I don't know. Soup says his uh, his his vintage is let's see his vintage bubblegum challenge is always on the table. One thousand. If we ever get one thousand likes during a live stream, it'll happen someday, Soup. Maybe not someday soon, but when it does, I'm gonna come knocking out your door with a video camera. It's gonna be like an episode of Cops. I'm gonna show up with a big old stack of vintage bubblegum, and you're gonna have to eat it right there. Uh, here's a hit behind Jesus Sanchez. Fragments of the farm. Tommy Romero. Bat a piece of the batter's eye from Bowling Green Ballpark. What you want? What you want to do? Bad boys, bad boys. What you going to do? Soup says, I'll be waiting. Uh, uh. You won't even know. You won't even know. I'm just going to sneak attack you. Genesis Cabrera, Jared Kellenick, Parker Meadows, Tatis Jr. Blake Rutherford. Tell, tell them that they're behind the counter, behind Uncle Yama. Logan Allen, O'Neill Cruz. Behind Tatis Jr., we got Cabrian Hayes, a little green parallel, numbered out of 99. 92 of 99. Saints fan from California says, Hi, card shop. So does Anthony Ojeda says, Hey, card shop, how's it going? Going pretty well, man. Just ripping. Ripping a box of uh, 2019 Tops Pro Debut for Patrick M., who is also up in the chat. Diaz. Chad Spanberger. Riley, Naylor, Lumberjacks Knight, Dustin May, there he is with that cool Tulsa Drillers. I love those Tulsa Drillers uniforms. I love those hats, too. Cancel and Carter Kaboom. Peg 400 says, hey, card shop. What's up, Peg? Peg! That's the title of a uh, Steely Dan song. Here's Kevin Maitan. Bo Burrows. Possibly something behind him. There's a backwards card for sure. There's Ashcraft, 
Libertore and Jameson Hanna. Let's see what's behind Bo Burrows. Spanberger. Spanberger here. There's, I believe, your second auto. Right? Didn't we get one earlier? Yes, we did get one earlier. So there's your two autos out of this box. Two autos and your two relics. And we still have a whole stack to go. We still have a whole stack to go. So potentially a bonus. Hopefully. Who knows? We're going to check them all out for you, though. Joe Adele, Graterall, Jackson, Jimenez, Francisco Lindor, a little, what, throwback card? Lake County Captains, that's kind of neat. Pash, Ramos, and Murphy rounding out that pack. Hunter Green right there. Ruiz, Jordan Groshans, Joe Adele again on the little leaps and bounds insert. Mobile Bay Bears, Khalil Lee, Keston Hura, Edward Cabrera, and Mickey Moniak. Will Stewart, Kiebert Ruiz, Roberts, Jeffers, Kyle Lewis, Brock Burke, Morahone, and Yadier Alvarez. Coming down to the last five packs for Patrick. We're getting football scores thrown up in here right now. Seven nothing, duh, Bears, I guess. Uh, Ornelas, Bishop, Trammell. White, Big Gavin Lux. He's been having some good performances with the Dodgers late in the season here. Sounds like he might make the 40-man roster for the playoffs, too. Florial, Widener, and Martinez. Medina, Manning, Pearson, Sanchez, Garbage plate night. I love these uniforms. I'd love to hook me up a, a uniform one of those. Those are so, those are sweet. Uh, Nova, Siegler, and Dalbeck. Got a nice Bobby Dalbeck on-card auto relic from our Bowman Chrome case that we broke on Friday. Uh, 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 strict Gaming says, Eric, your Facebook group has gotten my Braves PC looking good. I thank you for making the group and helping me boost my PC and make friends along the way. That's great, man. Happy to hear that. <clears throat> Who's your favorite player on the Braves? Or, or you just collect everybody, or do you have a specific player? I'm curious to know now. Here's Logan Webb, Brandon Marsh, Griffin Canning, Jake Wong, Neisner and um, Polar Bear Pete Alonzo coming out in one of the last one of the last packs. I think that's one of the first cards we've even seen of his in this box. Strict Gaming says Acuna, Freeman, and Chipper. Right on. Keep on keeping on, man. Have fun. Ryan Mountcastle, Howard Spencer, Luis Robert. So if, if you guys are just tuning in, you don't know what we're talking about, we have a trading group on Facebook. If you go to Facebook, search HOFBC Trading Group. It's free to join. It's all ages. It's for trades only. But uh, there's almost 300 people in that group now. It's like 275 or something. And you can trade with people. Make friends. You know, start small. Build up some trust with another guy or two. And, and start uh, making some trades. Strict Gaming says you need to join the group. It's so fun. There you go. Yeah, with a group of you know nearly 300 people, it makes trading just that much more easier. You just post a photo. Try not to overpost. I've learned that people don't like it when you just spam one photo after the next. You guys can put all your if you have 10 photos to show off, put them all in one post, and let just people scroll through the one post. 
But yeah, it's fun. It's a great little spot to do some trades. By the way, Patrick, this is your last pack. Here's Logan Allen. Allen. Tejeda, Christian Javier, and Connor Scott rounding out the box. So, Patrick, hopefully you enjoyed that. You got a couple nice numbered cards. Bo Naylor out of 10. Jordan Alvarez out of 99. The autos were Span, uh, Spanberger and Luke and Baker, which is pretty cool. Baker's a good auto to get. Not sure about Spanberger yet. And then your Fragments of the Farm cards, Tommy Romero, Will Benson. And the Will Benson was numbered out of 10. So that's decent, man. Thank you, Patrick. I don't know if that was up to snuff with what you were hoping. Do you still need to get that box of archives? I don't know. You're welcome to do so. If you want, right now, uh, by the way, if I didn't say thank you yet, thank you, Patrick. We appreciate it. Uh, now we have Andrew V with a quick rip, who's um, at, the, at the plate right now. Andrew V on deck, Brian H with absolute football, follow, followed by Heron got something in the wire, under the wire here. Box of Top's Finest. And if anyone else wants to get a box in as we're winding down the episode, Get those boxes in right now. Soup's just been dropping links like rhymes into our group chat. Click on any one of those links, uh, especially that last one that he just dropped. That'll take you to our group breaks pages. There's five pages. You, you get there, and then there's five additional pages right there. Five pages of products. Choose any product that says personal breaks in the title. And we'll rip it for you right now. You'll get free shipping. We'll ship it off to you for nothing. You'll get it later this week because we'll ship them all out tomorrow. All right, Andrew. Andrew, you ready for this, buddy? Don't blink. It's a quick rip. One encased buyback autograph. He's hoping for a big auto right now. Do not blink. Here we go. One, two, three. Oh! Wow. One of one! One of one! Clayton Kershaw on wow. card auto! You wanted a big one? That's about as big as it gets, baby. Woo! Yeah. Woo! I five. Yeah! Andrew V! What up, Andrew? That's about as big as it gets, man. Archives. Woo, that's a tough rip, but you got lucky, my friend. There's no other way to put it. Let's take a closer look at this, starting with the autograph. Look at that thing. Clayton Kershaw on card autograph right there on what looks to be a 2017 Topps Chrome card. Stamped archives up here, and then right next to the brim of his hat, there's the one of one stamp right there. This is the only card in the world like it. Woo! Yeah, buddy, that's what we're talking about. That's the kind of energy we need to see right now. I needed to see that right now. I needed a little boost. That's like a shot of something. A little shot of Red Bull right there, right to the heart. Wow. What's Andrew saying? Is Andrew passed out? Running around my room right now, he says. <laughs> Yeah, I bet you are, man. I bet you are. The chat just blew up right now. The chat just blew up. Everybody's saying, wow. Soup says, only at HOFBC. That's a sick card right there, man. Andrew, congrats, buddy. You jumped in at the right time on that. Wow. Wowie, wow, wow, wow. I can't even say much more than that. I'm just going to... Uh, put your box to the side, but Kershaw here is going to preside right here over the rest of this break. He's got to just, he's just got to kick it right here in the corner. There he is. Boom. Just like that. Just to remind everybody what could happen. Wow, that's the best out of archives. That's sick. That's one of the best cards I've seen out of archives all year. Wow. That's awesome. That's so sick. On the tops chrome, too. It doesn't get much better. That's a really rare card, Jaden. So this card right here, you see this? I'm going to show Jaden real quick. See, it's got, it says one out of one. That means this is the only card in the world like it. Wow. Have you ever heard of Clayton Kershaw? Mm -hmm. Have you? He plays for the Dodgers. He's their ace pitcher. 
Man, that's nasty. That's so sick. Andrew, it's going to be picture time at the shop. Make sure to wear something nice. Clean yourself up. We're going to take a picture of that, post that on social later on. That's cool, man. All right. Let's see if we can keep, keep the fire going for new contestant, new batter at the plate, Brian H. I believe this is his first time getting in with us. Brian H., are you still there? Brian H., looking for Brian H. up in the chat. Uh, hopefully he's still hanging on. Brian H., not sure if Brian H. is still here. Sometimes people have to leave, or they got kids, or they got other stuff going on. So, Brian H., uh, if you're not still here, obviously you can watch this video later. I wish you were here. You were here earlier. I want you to be here. I don't see him commenting anytime in the recent future, so maybe he's not here. We do remind the uh, chatters, just please take it easy on the spam. Our moderators do not like when you spam the chat. You will possibly be timed out or blocked. Okay, Brian, I got to get going with this box for you. Hopefully you come back from wherever you're at. If not, you can watch this box break later because this video will remain on our channel. This is some football. Football cards. Panini Absolute Football. Three mini boxes per master. All right, let's see what's up. I'm just going to start with the first mini box. Good luck to Brian. Everybody wish Brian good luck. It doesn't seem like he's in the chat anymore. He must have had to leave. Everybody say good luck to Brian. Let's see. Let's talk football for a minute, folks. Good luck. <clears throat> Here we go. Jaden says good luck. All right, first pack. Your favorite football team? Yeah, my favorite football team is the um, the Rams. The Rams. All right, I like that. We got him back, buddy. We got him. All right, who else likes football? Let's see. Uh, Soup loves the Chiefs. Kaysen? I guess Kaysen might be a Bears fan because he keeps dropping the score of that game. We got Eli Manning on the front card here. Jalen Ramsey. Here you go. Oh, thank you. Yeah, just stick it right on the edge right here so it hangs off. There you go. Perfect. Eli Manning. We got Ramsey. We got um, Amari Cooper, numbered 45 out of 75. That was Cowboys. That was Cowboys. And then the hits. The hits. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Ooh, come on. Oh, I was hoping that would be signed. I was really hoping that would have been signed. But a little hint of PM2. That's what I like to call him, PM2. PM2, Patrick. A little swatch out of 199. And uh, the ever popular Panini Rewards Points, which I won't show the full rewards points because of potential codes or whatnot, but you do got 400 points to spend on Panini's website. That'll probably get you another Patrick Mahomes jersey numbered out of 199. <laughs> uh, I meant to ask Panini when we were at the summit about their rewards points, but I didn't want to ruin the vibe. <laughs> Everyone was chilling. <laughs> I didn't want to be that guy. Uh, so, all right, first pack for uh, Brian H. Mahomes and points there. Let's see what else might come out of the second pack. There's the loop. Patrick was asking for the link to the uh, to the shop. Yeah, Soup just dropped it right there. Click that. We still got some time. If you want to get another box in, we still got time. Get a box for personal breaks. We'll rip it. We'll ship it for free, and you'll get it later this week. Here's uh, Gilmore. 
Here's Matt Ryan. Uh, we also have uh, another Amari Cooper in the same spot. And this one's numbered two out of 50. That's funny. Plus a little promotional card behind him. Let's see what kind of hits we got. Hits are Keelan Doss. And a uh, little team tandem dual relic. Smith Jr. and Kyle Rudolph. Keelan Doss card's pretty cool. A little rookie autograph, number 20 out of 25. What's the status on this guy? Where's Matty? Where's card shop Matt when I need him? He's our resident Raiders fan. Anybody watching right now, what's the status on Doss? I'm guessing he's a backup to, uh, what's his name? Gamma, what's his name? <laughs> QB for the Raiders, who I'm blanking on right now. D Carr. I'm guessing he's the backup to Carr. Ah, Brian H., you're back. There you are, buddy. All right. Did you just get back? I just am seeing your chat right now. You said sorry. Was that your first thing that you said in here for a while? So I'll show you what you've gotten so far hit-wise. Nothing crazy yet. We've done two of three mini boxes in your box. You just got the Keelan Doss rookie autograph, 20 out of 25. Probably could also see the Irv Smith Jr. Uh, Kyle Rudolph dual relic out of 199. Uh, the first mini box, you got uh, Mahomes Relic out of 199, and then behind that was Panini Rewards Points, which I usually don't show the full rewards cards for fear of giving away a code or something, but that'll be coming out to you. And then we have one more mini box out of here for you, Brian. Soup says, for my single pack, have Jaden open it. All right, yeah, let's do that. Uh, Yama, uh, when you get a chance, grab a pack of that Prism baseball. I'll have Jaden open it later at the end. Cool, perfect. Uh, here's your last pack, Brian H. You've already gotten four hits. I think there's only five hits in a master box, so I'm guessing there's only one hit in this pack. All right, let's see who's in here. Flacco. <laughs> Andrew V asking obvious questions. He says, hey, what's that card in the back there? Is that a Kershaw Auto one of one? Uh, yeah, buddy, we pulled that for you about 15 minutes ago. Remember that? Remember that? One of one Clayton Kershaw Auto? Yeah, that's right. Uh, here's Joe Flacco. Here is uh, Gridiron Force, Joe Green, Mean Joe Green, 17 out of 25. Would love to have seen that signed. We've also got Alex Barnes, 70 of 100. We've got Ryan Finley, 171 of 199. And the final hit should be behind Finley. Tony Pollard, triple relic autograph, number 309 of 399, including a swatch of football right there. Rookie Premier Materials, Dallas Cowboys, Tony Pollard right there. Became the second Memphis player to be drafted by the Cowboys in franchise history, John Bomer, first in 1971. Joined Darrell Henderson on Memphis, uh, Memphis running backs to be drafted the top four rounds 2019. Ranked second Memphis history with 4680 career all-purpose yards. AAC Special Teams Player of the Year as freshman 2016. There you go, Brian. You weren't in the chat earlier, so I didn't get a chance to ask you, Brian, what your favorite team, uh, football team was, but you're welcome to throw that down in the chat right now. By chance, was it Cowboys? <laughs> That'd be good. <clears throat> Brian says, thanks, guys. 
Happy to have you, Brian. And would love to have you back. Hopefully you're uh, enjoying this experience. <clears throat> Pack up those cards tomorrow, ship them out tomorrow afternoon. Yeah, is this the backup guy for Zeke? I heard he was doing pretty well. Is this the, is this the backup guy that was doing pretty well in the preseason before Zeke made a decision? Uh, Tony Pollard? I think it is. Now batting, by the way, thank you to Brian H. Now batting, Michael F.H. with a box of finest. Uh, on deck, we got James M. with a box of Cornerstones basketball. And then uh, we're going to open up this pack of Prism for soup. Jaden's going to open that up later on in a little bit. If anybody else wants to get any more boxes for personal breaks open tonight, we still have some time. Get those orders in now by clicking the link that Soup has been bombarding into the group chat. Click that link. We got five pages of personal breaks to choose from. You'll get free shipping. They're going to ship out tomorrow. You get to watch it go down right now. And we still got some time. Get those orders in. All right, Heron, where are you at, buddy? Where's Heron? Let's see if, there he is, here. It's, let's see, the chase for Polar Bear Pete continues. All right, Michael Heron has become our resident Mets fan. They've been trying all season long, it seems like, to find a, a Pete Alonzo autograph for him. Which stack do you want me to open up first, Heron? This one here or the second one? I'm going to open them both right now, but which one would you like me to rip first? Do you care? Let's see what Heron says. Soup says, best of luck, Heron. And he wants the second one. All right, that'll be this one right here. Uh, you know what? I'm going to start on the bottom. Let's see if we have uh, some good luck starting on the bottom of the stack like we did for David B.R.'s packs earlier. Two chrome autographs per master box. Let's see what comes out of this first pack. Keep your fingers crossed for Pete Alonzo, everybody. Here's Carlos Correa. Albert Pujols. Jose Altuve. I just like saying Altuve. And dang old Jose Altuve. Salvador Perez and uh, Eloy Jimenez. All right, nothing crazy there. First pack done. Zach Granke. Justin Smoke. Ahmed Rosario. That's a good Yankee. I like him. Or Met, excuse me. Mm, sorry. <laughs> uh, Mitch Hanager and Josh Bell. <clears throat> Aaron Judge. Jose Ramirez. Maybe an autograph behind him. It's hard to tell. Marcus Stroman, Chris Bryant. Maybe an autograph back here behind Jose Ramirez. No, Jake Bowers. Fooled me. Just a refractor. All right. Blackman. Buxton. I believe there's an autograph behind Buxton. Mookie Betts. Corbin Burns. See the little white... On the card behind Buxton, there's a little white spot there that usually indicates the spot where the players will sign. Let's see. Oh, let's see. Let's just reveal the hat. Do you think it's going to be Mets? Come on. I'm looking at a dark, a dark hat. I don't think Mets wear dark. Well, they do wear the black with the orange, don't they? But definitely Luke Voigt is who it is. It's not. It's the, it's the other New York team. 
It's the it's the wrong New York team. We weren't channeling the correct New York team, everybody. Luke Voigt. His autograph looks like his, something came off a Richter scale. <laughs> That's a California joke. <laughs> Yankee vo vomit. <laughs> Bronx always show at the wrong time, says Cam Vet. All right. Well, we're getting close. Maybe we can just bump that over to the to the Mets side of town. Let's see what else lingering in this little mini box here. Hosmer, Polanco, Meadows, Acuna, and DJ Stewart. Chris Shaw, Justice Sheffield, Ryan Barucki, Refractor, Jose Abreu, and Paul DeYoung. All right. Heron, do you want to predict the auto, or do you want me to just go at it? Uh, there's six packs here. One of them should include an autograph. Hopefully, Mr. Pete Alonzo. Do you want to try to pick a number or an order that you want me to pick, uh, rip those in? He says four. One, two, three, four is what he's saying. All right. I really want to make this happen for you. I just want it to happen. Not that I have anything to do with making it happen. I wish I did. But I'd really love to see it happen for you, buddy. Let's see Crawford, Davis, Billy Hamilton. Starlin Castro and Aaron Nola, so no hit there. Uh, let's see. You want another? You want another pick, Heron? One, two, three, four, five. Heron says four again. One, two, three, four. All right. Lorne Arenado, J.D. Martinez, potential autograph behind him, Josh Hader, David Peralta. All right. All right, buddy. It's blue, I think. I think it's blue. Look, that looks to be bluish right there. Doesn't that look blue to you? Definitely looks blue. I would love I mean, how do you want me to reveal this? Do you want to see the helmet first? Do you want to see the helmet, or you just want me to rip it off like a Band-Aid? Slow roll, Heron, or rip off like Band-Aid? What do you want? Call it, Heron. I'm waiting for you, buddy. Helmet. All right, he wants the slow roll. Let's check out behind the helmet. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, I see a baseball up in the corner. Oh, uh, and I see a, and a Braves logo. I see a Braves logo. Potential pitcher for the Braves. It's numbered. 134 out of 150. Who is this? Allard? Who is it? I don't recognize that face. Anybody recognize that face? Let's check it out. It is Colby Allard. Colby Allard. <clears throat> nice blue on-card rookie auto, though, numbered out of 150. Well, we didn't hit your Polar Bear autographed card, but there's still four packs left. You never know. Who knows? Maybe there's a crazy Super Fractor waiting back there. Let's check them out, shall we? The chase continues indeed. All right, let's check out the rest of these packs, see if anything else cool might be lingering. Asturio, Acuna, uh, Yusei Kikuchi, rookie card, upside down for no reason. Joey Votto and Miguel Cabrera.
Kyle Tucker, Anthony Rizzo, Salvador Perez, uh, Miguel Andahar is purple, and Miguel Andahar regular. Purple's number 24 out of 250. D. Gordon. What's up to Joseph Hewitt, by the way? He says, I'm a big fan of you and Dodger Films. Joseph Hewitt, do you know Mr. Soup from Dodger Films? Is probably still in the chat right now. Maybe he'd say what up to you. His real name's Luis Valdez. I don't know if you knew that much. Here's Michael Kopeck, finest first rookies. Here's Lindor. There's Cody Bellinger. Last pack for Heron for right now. And there he is. Trey Turner, Willie Adames, Blake Snell, Chance Adams, and Ramon Laureano in the final pack. So not even a whiff of the polar bear out of this box. Not even a whiff, but you got a few nice cards. You got the Andahar purple out of 250, the Allard blue rookie auto out of 150, and the Voigt. Refractor Auto. Thanks, Michael. Michael says, thanks, Shop. You got it, buddy. It's always a pleasure to have you. Uh, winding it down here, folks. Winding it down. It looks like James M. is going to get the last box. Then we got a little pack that we owe soup. From a couple breaks ago that Jaden's going to open up. But well, this is, looks like it's going to be it. James, are you still with us? Yes, he says sweet right there. All right, James wanted to do some Cornerstones basketball. Fun product. Let's see what could be lingering inside. Cam Bet says, Soup and Card Shop are the perfect duo on a team together. Yes, he's like the, I'm the, I'm the Batman, he's like the Robin. It is perfect. <laughs> oh, yes. I'm just going to let that hang out there for a minute. <laughs> All right, James, let's check out your Cornerstones box. If I can get it out, we will check it out. Evans, uh, no, let's see, Andrew V says Jaden is back. <laughs> I really, I think I got soup with that with that joke right there. <laughs> Julie likes, Julie also likes Fernando. I haven't seen Fernando for a minute. He's busy raising a daughter and doing other things. I do like Fernando. He's one of my favorite guys. All right, James M. Oh, my neck is hurting, so it's probably good that this is one of our last boxes here. Brooke Lopez. James M. For, uh, Luca is what he wants, of course. Not Brooke Lopez. Base card, number whatever, 139. Oh, Vince Carter. I was hoping that would have been signed. I like Vince Carter, man, of course. I don't even know how to do this for you right now. Let's look at this back card. Jokic right there, numbered out of 79. Just going to try to put all these. What are we, we two autos and one relic in here. So it should be all three of these middle cards. Let's just go. I'm going to flip these over. We're going to go top to bottom. Let's flip over this stack right here. Ooh, how about Robert, Robert Ori? <laughs> Hey, as a Laker fan, I like that. I don't, I'm, not, I'm not sure if James M. is going to appreciate that as much as I do, but, man, that guy was so clutch for us. 26 of 129, franchise pillars. He certainly was a pillar of the Lakers team back in that, in that era, mid-2000s. Ori, D. Fish, Kobe, Shaq, boom, come on. Big shot Bob right here. James N., 
Seems to like it. Seems to like it. Numbered. Cool. Bobby Ori. Let's see what's behind him. Let me get rid of this card that I showed off earlier. That was the Vince Carter card. Behind Ori, we have. I think it's going to be upside down this way. Let's see if we can recognize this face right here. Recognize that face? It's hard to tell. It looks kind of like Eddie Murphy. It looks kind of like Eddie Murphy. But I don't think he plays basketball, and he's got no reason being in this card. Let's see who it is. Tamar DeRozan. DeRozan. San Antonio Spurs relic. Okay, behind that, this doesn't look numbered unless it's numbered on the back, but I just want to get to the Cornerstones card behind it. I'm seeing red, which leads me to believe it may not be Luca, because wouldn't it be blue on the card for him? Unless maybe it's a red parallel. Yeah, there's some red. Oh, definitely not Luca. What do you think it is? Troy Brown Jr. comes out on the Cornerstones card right there. It's numbered 8 out of 10. He's a rookie with the Wizards. Four swatches and a nice on-card auto. Pretty dope-looking card for sure. James M., not sure how you feel about it. James says, DC, word. What's up? That is going to do it with your box of corner stones. Let me see if this sleeve will fit this card real quick. Yes, it will. So get that in a sleeve for you. Get this in a sleeve for you. Get Mr. Ori in a sleeve. Wrong size. Here we go. Hold on. Cool, so those are your three cards. Robert Ori, my favorite one. DeRozan and uh, Troy Brown Jr. That's a nice looking card. James M says thanks. Thank you, James. We, uh, we, all, we also appreciate your continued support. We wouldn't be able to do these little episodes without you guys. We're glad you guys are into it. This is fun for us. Glad it's fun for you guys. And Jaden is now scooting his chair up. Why? <laughs> he knows why. Uh, he gets to open a pack of cards. I think I might have thrown away the sticker. Oh, no. It's stuck to your shirt. There we go. Boom. That's that. We got Kershaw still just uh, presiding right here for Andrew V. That's so sick. By the way, if you guys tuned in just now and you missed this early, we had a little quick rip of archives for Andrew V., and ended up with a one-of-one one Clayton Kershaw autograph, which is pretty sick. One-of-one, one, right at the top of the card there. My lighting's getting bad because it's getting dark. But, yeah, that was sick. And so that's probably going to do it for personal breaks tonight. Looks like it's slowed down for us right now. Thanks to everyone who jumped in. We appreciate you jumping into personal breaks. Um, we're back on next Monday, right, Yama? Back on personal breaks next Monday at 4 p.m., plus whatever else happens to sell out between now and then. We do have Bowman, a Bowman group break for only 35 bucks a spot. You can help us sell that out in the meantime. We'll try to create a couple other breaks for you guys to get into as well. Um, we owe Soup a pack of Prism baseball cards from one of our weekend breaks last weekend where he guessed the numbered card challenge correctly. And uh, and he said he wants Jaden to open up this pack. Jaden is Chris's Yama's nephew. You want to do this? You want to sit in this chair? Sure. Okay. So here, let me let me let Jaden sit down into this chair. I'm just gonna put the little pack on the stand for you right there. See that? So here, I'm gonna teach you how to do this. He's never even sat in this chair before. So sit in the chair, watch the camera. Be very careful not to bump the camera. Be careful not to bump the camera. Let's see. Let's scoot you up a little bit. Without, hold on. Don't bump the camera. Whatever you do, do not bump in the camera. Okay. Let's see if Jaden. So you're gonna want to take your hands, 
going to go around the camera. You probably saw me doing it like that, right? And here, you can open up this pack for soup right now. You know how to open packs? You've opened a pack before, right? Yeah. All right. See if we can do this. See how well. Make sure, try not to bump the camera. It might be hard. I might, be able to, might need to get some scissors out to open the top for you, or I can help. Want me to help you get it started? I'll get it started for you. These panini prism packs can be a little difficult. There we go. There it is. Started. Now you can slide them out or you can rip it right down the middle here like this. Watch. Rip that seam right down the middle. <laughs> this little seam right here. Watch. See that? That rips right down the middle like that. See? Youngster here. Yama's, Yama's nephew, Jaden. So, so when you open the cards... Keep the cards right here. So watch. Keep the cards. See, see, this camera shows them off right there. You see that? Yeah, this is my new, this is my new breaker right here, folks. <laughs> Look out. Hey, hey, hey. So watch. Here, do this. Here, this is the easy way to do it. You can just pull them right all out of the pack, hold them like this, and then see, you can you can either watch them in front of you or you can watch the camera as you do it, and then you just then you just you just do, just set it to the side, and then then look at the next one. Yeah. yeah, that's that's fine. Can you hold them a little further away, or is it a little hard? It's a little hard for them to hold it because you kind of want to you kind of want to show the players' names on the camera screen. You see that? You can also look at this camera screen if you want. Hold it up. That's better. Hold the hold the cards up. <laughs> We're just having some family fun here at there the end, go. folks. <clears throat> This is for oh, Pat Patrick Patrick M said he bought a box of archives right now. <laughs> this is for soup. This is for soup. These are all for soup. Yeah, here, try to hold them up like right here, like right, like right there is perfect. See how they're right in the middle of the screen when you hold them right there? Yeah. Perfect. There's Andrew Benintendi for the Red Sox. Now that one's upside down. That's Albert Pujols for the Angels. That's a prism card. Those are cool looking, huh? Austin wins right there. We got, who's that? Brandon Nimmo. We've got Joey Gallo, Lumber. Oh, we get an autograph? You get an autograph? This next card might be autographed, this one. Turn that around, see if there's a signature on it. Yeah, look at that. Show it off, show off the camera. That's, that's what Soup wants to see. There you go, Soup. You pulled. Jaden just pulled you an autograph. He's pulling fire. Fire. New breaker pulling fire. Put this one away. Show off that autograph card a little bit more for Soup. Show off that autograph to the camera here. Yeah, there you go. See, it's right in the middle of the screen. There you go, buddy. There you go. <laughs> and there. Say say hi, Soup. Say thanks, Soup. Thanks, Soup. Hi, Soup. How <laughs> There we go. Everybody say good job to Jaden. Give him a little thumbs up or something. And uh, now we're gonna open a pack of. Uh, we're gonna open a pack of archives for uh, Patrick. Oh, archive signatures. He wants to try. Me? Uh, I'll do this for I'll do this for him unless unless Patrick wants you to open it. But Patrick, what do you say? You want you think Jaden's got the luck for you right now, or do you want me to open? Get a sleeve on this autograph for Superman, Riley Farrell. Patrick says Jaden should do it. Okay. Okay, get back in the seat. Watch the camera. Get back in the seat. Don't bump the camera. Whoa, see. <laughs> All, right, buddy, come on. All right, this one I'm going to have to show you how to do it. All right, Patrick, this is his sticker, so that goes here. That one goes on Soup's thing. So this... This is just one card. You saw it. You saw me open this one, right? Yeah. Opens it. There's just one card inside. But first, you have to take off the plastic wrap, which means I take the little cutter. Now take off the plastic wrap. Dude. Yeah, okay. There you go. There you go. All right, keep it on camera. So, so, now... Now tell Patrick you've got one encased buyback autographed card in this box. You got one encased buyback. Louder, buddy. Yeah, say it loud. Right here. Here's the microphone right here. You got um, 
right. one pack of cards in this case. <laughs> one in case autograph buyback card, and it's going to be right under this lid, Jaden. You can just open up that lid and show him the card. Let's see if you can figure it out here. Here, here, I'll get you started. There we go. That lid just opens up, and the card's right there. Who is it? Who is it? Hold it in front of the camera so he can see it. <laughs> and tell him the name. Who's the name? Jed Lowry. Jed Lowry. Lowry yeah. And look, it's numbered. Look, 7 out of 85. Jed Lowry. I love those A's uniforms right wow. there. See, there it is. <laughs> there you go, Patrick. You just had the first, uh, the first break from a six-year-old. Maybe ever. Ever. Maybe ever right there. <laughs> that's awesome. And that's how we do it at Hall of Fame Baseball Cards. This is our family business since 1981. Get involved in our group breaks or our personals. Stop by the shore, the store. Become part of the family here. <laughs> Thanks, Patrick. Appreciate your support. Appreciate Goodbye, everybody. Oh, Soup. Soup says you can have his cards. He just gave you all these cards that you just opened up. Oh, what do you there you go. Thank you, Soup. There you go. Wait, I have these cards? Yeah. Oh, he just gave them to you. Those are yours now. Thank you, Soup. And okay. <laughs> Patrick says he's out of money. Well, save up. We'll be back next week. <sighs> Thanks to everybody who jumped in tonight. Uh, Bye, big, Hall of Fame. Big, there goes Jaden. Say goodbye to Jaden. Big hit of the night is right there on camera still. Clayton Kershaw, one of one autograph, pulled by Andrew. Andrew, come pick that up this week. We'll take some photos. Thanks to everybody who jumped in. Uh, jump into our Bowman uh, group break. Or pick up a box for yourself today at HallOfFameBaseballCards.com. We'd love to have you. We appreciate you guys. Thanks for hitting that like button. Thanks for the positivity in the group chat. And I uh, hope everybody has a great night. So what's up to Grace and Jose in Monrovia? What's up, guys? Thanks, everybody. We appreciate you all. We're looking forward to seeing you again soon. Peace.